In this video, I'm going to teach you how to use Apple Wallet on iPad. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to set up the Apple Wallet if you only have access to an iPad. So the Apple Wallet does not exist as a standalone application on an iPad. However, the functionality is integrated into the iPad's system for making payments. So all that you have to do to use it and add cards is first open the settings app on your iPad and there go over over to the wallet and Apple Pay category. This option will take you to the settings for your payment information and just like you would with the Apple Wallet, you will be able to add a card. So choose the option to add a new card or choose from previous cards already added. Follow the on-screen instructions to add your credit or debit card. You will be able to confirm all of the details and verify the owner of the card and it is going to be linked into your Apple account. Now that this is done, you can use Apple Pay for purchases within apps or on the web using Safari and in some physical stores with compatible payment terminals. If you are trying to do this process in specific apps, websites, all that you have to do is proceed to checkout and look for the Apple Pay button. Tap it and then you will be able to authenticate the option or this purchase with Face ID or Touch ID. It's simple and the prompt will be automatically opened as soon as you choose to purchase something. Just make sure that you select any of the cards currently attributed to your Apple wallet. And if you are doing this process in store, you will usually have to do a contactless payment by placing your iPad near the card reader. But this might not be as reliable as doing this process with a phone. So I highly recommend that you look for the option to use Apple Pay during checkout. Like I mentioned, as long as you attribute the cards to the same Apple account, you will be able to use your iPad with new cards or the pre-existing ones that you had on other devices. I hope I was able to help you on how to use Apple Wallet on iPad. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.